Истинный в огне Кто читает свои сны Поклоняюсь в темноте The people of the island lived happily until the volcano erupted. And that's when the island was thrown into chaos. When the volcano first erupted, lava flowed into the surrounding areas, which included Retail Row and Lonely Lodge, killing many of their inhabitants. Then the dust and smoke lifted into the air, and so a nuclear winter started. It lasted for many years, and during that time, the island became a shell of its former self. Many people died from starvation, disease, and also from killing each other. The people of the island could barely breathe the air, and the dust blocked out the sun which made farming impossible. But what was yet to come was something that was worse than all of this combined. Monsters started to appear and come out of the volcano. These monsters were known as firewalkers. They were skeletons but covered in fire that could not be extinguished. They started hunting the remaining survivors and killed many of them. But eventually the people came together and that's when the war started. The war was brutal. Many of the survivors who were still alive were killed. But eventually the survivors destroyed most of the firewalkers and they retreated back to the volcano that they had crawled out from. At this point, it had been over a decade since the eruption, and the people of the island who were still alive started to rebuild what had been destroyed during the eruption, the nuclear winter, and the war. Eventually, the nuclear winter ended and the island slowly started to return back to the way it was. But after a few years passed, the volcano erupted once more, and the people of the island knew what was coming. But what they didn't know was that the firewalkers were only minions to something much, much worse. They were minions to the King of Fire. The King sent his hordes of minions to attack the island. And so, the people of Fortnite started gearing up for the second Firewalker War.